was just a prank, Han. Today is the one-year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness... Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah, yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. Well, watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? <coughs> yes! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. OK, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay, um, is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute, did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Well, then ask who it is. Probe, clarify. Who needs help? Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. Sister. R. Sister. Sister? Who's sister? Oh, come on. Is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Oh God, okay, let's try Beth. Who are we speaking to? Beth? Is that you? Yes. Oh God. This is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If, if this is actually Beth, I mean, we, we can find out what happened that night. Oh, okay. Um, let me think. Ask what happened. Beth, we want to know what happened to you that night. Can you tell us? H A N N. It's spelling Hannah. Wait, it's still going. K I Hank. L L. Oh my God. Hand kill. Guys, guys, what's she talking about? I don't know if I can keep doing this. We have to. Just, just, just stay calm. I, I think it's saying that someone. Kill Hannah. I don't know. I just a ask it something else. Let's clarify. Okay. Okay. How was Hannah killed? L. I. B. L the library. Maybe there's something in the library. E. R. O. Oh. Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. oh. Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit, Chris! You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, I don't know 
I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not Ash's fault. I don't need fault. this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man, I'm, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? <laughs> Jess? We gotta go find her. Jess, where did you go? This is not funny. If only they had a little thing called a cell phone. God, these kids today, man, they're so dumb. Jessica, oh, come on. Dude, for reals, it's Jess? not. What's Buddy. this? You in there? I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna regret this. Out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? Why didn't the? I'm surprised it didn't capture it. It's just a mask, isn't it? Yes. One minute. Let me check something. It didn't count. <laughs> Apparently, that wasn't one. All right, whatever. Hun? I knew I that was gonna mind. happen, though. This game is full of that kind of stuff. They call them cheap shots for a reason. When you're least expecting it. Hence a jump scare. It's been used in horror I films totally for years. Promise. I won't murder you. You're filming. You're I filming me. No! Oh my god. No. <laughs> that was so good. Not, no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. You had to see this. You had to I'm not seeing it. No. No. no, no, no. <laughs> you recorded that? <laughs> That's kind of funny. I was scared, Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry to scare you. If you send that to anybody, I'm what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like Scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you scared the pants off of them. I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh! Oh. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills. I don't know. It's going to be like how the girl cried wolf. Now, the thing is, I wasn't startled because I saw the light on my camera go on. You know what I mean? That thing kind of gave it away. It's kind of ironic. I mean, it wants you. Ooh, what's this? It wants you. Oh, this is a tiki, isn't it? It wants you to look at the screen, and I saw it, but I was half expecting it because they're like, oh, there was no camera shot there. I don't know. It's a yellow one again. Or is that a white one? Oh, that's a guidance totem. So it shows you where to go. We have a lot of the guidance. We have three of them out of a possible six. Oh, I get it. Places you could hide to make... Oh, uh, is that what it is? Places you could possibly hide. Or, or ways to not die. You know what I mean? Where are we going? I think we're going backwards. I'm gonna head to the waterfall. There's just something about it that tells me. 
So if I end up getting all the guidance, uh, guidance things, I might be able to avoid certain death. And that will greatly help me, let's be honest. Come on, mate. Looking a little precarious. There may have been something there. Kind of like a real winter wonderland out here now. Hey, girl, you know how good. I may have missed something back there, though. It just I don't remember which way I went. I wonder when shit's really gonna get real. Didn't, didn't they already, didn't they already hear a sound like that, or was that a different group of folk? Shh. What? Do you hear that? No. Hello? Someone there? Damn! That thing almost killed us. You're fine. You're fine. So remember how it said the best thing to do isn't always throw the rock or, or isn't always to act. So if I didn't throw it, I probably could have gotten away with it. Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Yeah. I think she's being facetious. What the fuck? What is that? An old mining mask. The name inside says it belongs to a miner called Billy Bates. <laughs> Sweet revenge. Fuck it. God, what does she think is going to happen? Although that could actually affect her. She could freeze. She shouldn't be wearing that anymore, so. <laughs> I don't know, man. She may think I'm kidding, though, when something bad happens. Anyway. Good thing she likes him so much. Where do these even go? Like, there's a lot of- Whoa! God damn it. Dude, there's like a million jump scares in this game. There's so many, you kind of half expect them. What is that? Not sure I want to know. Uh-oh. I think something- Look. This damn thing just got bit. Damn. This buck. It's horrible. Jeez, I don't think he's gonna make it. Dude, kill the deer. Just kill it. Uh. 
Okay, bud. Hey. I'm gonna make this quick for you, okay? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. You gotta break uh, his neck, brother. How do I... Uh, I can't watch this. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Ah! Whoa! That shouldn't have happened! Wait, what, what did you do? What the fuck? It came up! Ah! Ah! Whoa! What the... Whoa! Got it. Get over here. <gasps> Almost missed that. It's gotta be a bear. <laughs> follow the path. Follow the path. Stay on the path. We're almost there. Quick, man. Oh, my gosh. I don't mean to alarm you, but hurry. Of course she falls. Damn, we should have grabbed the key. On, we gotta go. I am. <sighs> Mike, get the key, get it open. Go, man. Oh, oh my God, that was close. Uh, what? Had it under control. Hold time. Oh, bullshit. No, hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred and ten. That was pretty carrot crazy. I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Cuz, I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Uh, okay. I know better. Almost we all know better. Feeling relaxed again. Almost. It's gonna catch you off guard. Huh. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Wow. We don't need a fire to heat things up. Dude, make. I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice, cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Dude, make the damn fire. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. I don't like that. The stereotypical boss, every boss I'm around, do everything bullshit. My girl would never do that, ever. Like, she'd be good to go no matter where the fuck, or she'd be like, okay, I, I, that's fine, we don't have to make a fire. She wouldn't give a fuck. True story. Actually, back out for a minute. Let me just look around this place first. I might need some flint. Unless you want to make out with an ice sculpture, I suggest you get a fire going. Pronto. Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Oh. Oh. Ow! Hey, what, are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. I did not! It's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. What's going on? Shit. Oh, fuck. Mike! What? Oh. Her phone. Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Yes, slow down. What phone. Is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. No, doesn't he have it? Yeah. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. Damn it, man. It's gotta be outside. Probably, no, don't yeah, go outside. I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. I just wish you hadn't gotten me completely soaking wet trying to scare me. Kind of a dick move. I'm sorry, Jess. Probably There's your butterfly. Water and doesn't even work anymore anyway, so whatever. Hey, I'll make it up to you. I promise. 
So that's what happened with butterflies. Oh, a set of matches. Solid. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? All right, what else we got here? Oh, Gun rack. Jess, look at this. Is it a fire? No, way cooler. I'm not gonna scare her this time. Oh god, something by the window. I don't trust we'll never this. I understand what we have together. All right, let's keep looking. I was a little scared of that. What's over here? Native American myths and legends. The mother bear returned. She was enraged and attacked the merchant. Mighty Eagle saw this and swooped at the merchant as he ran through the trees, but a gunshot frightened Eagle away. The merchant was leaving the forest and was gleeful, thinking of the money that would soon be his. But when the tree fell blocking his way, he had to turn back to find Blah. That's where he met... Okay, I can't read it. Looks like we weren't the only ones to meet. Hold on. Ah. I, ah, I missed one, man. That's so annoying. Updated, because we know now what this is. According to the book in the cabin, the symbols are to ward off evil spirits. Interesting. Showing symbols which the Native Americans used to keep evil spirits away. Native American hunters used symbols and signs scratched onto trees or daub, daubled, daubed into walls to communicate with the other tribe members. Many symbols conveyed religious or mythical beliefs. Others warned of danger or offered protection. Some told of good hunting grounds. Uh, most symbols were specific to the tribe that used it, and it would be unrecognizable to other tribes. Shown below and opposite are some symbols used by tribes in North America and Canada. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? You're fucking... Oh, wait a minute. No! I don't know if either whoever made this game's a fucking idiot, or if they're just saying in Northern America... You know what I mean? Like, United States? Because last time I checked, Canada's in North America, you dumb fucks. Like, look at that shit. In North America and Canada. Canada's not a part of North America. Unless, of course, like I said, they're meaning Northern America. Like, the Northern States. Like, Washington, Oregon, uh, Wyoming. Shit like that. Like, I don't know if that's what they mean or not. It could just be a, the way they spelt it. I'm thinking they, they, it, it means North America, the continent. Because, look at they've got two capitals. Two capital letters on North and America. In case you guys didn't fucking know, Mexico's actually a part of North America. Just saying. God. Anyway. Image of a hunter symbol. Good hunting ground. Image of a butterfly symbol. Vision uh, or dream of the future. Image image of a skull. A ward or spell protecting against evil spirits. Okay, that's good to remember. Friendly <coughs> neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Alright. Alright, hold on. Before I light this fire, I'm gonna check shit out over here. What's this? There's the eagle right there, dude. In the story. That looks like Hannah. Is that Hannah? A framed photo of Hannah playing tennis, winning bronze, Alberta Invitational 2013. So are these guys in Canada then? Like, I'm confused. Maybe these are Canadians. I don't know. Because Alberta is my province. That's where I live. Stop. Stop it. Dude, rotate. There we go. Okay. Controls are a little wonky, though, sometimes. There we go. What's this? Oh, 
Hell yeah. These guys were inventive. God. Whoa. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Huh. It's, a, it's like a Karma Sutra sex book. Let me guess, there's something in the fucking thing. I don't want to do this. Chill, it's a shower curtain. Fucking shit, fuck, fuck shit. Dude, you're a pussy. was in there, Mike? Come on. That's what I was saying. It's a fucking shower curtain. Chill. I knew they would try and get us with some sort of mini... The thing is, I've noticed the developers are trying to get you with every little thing. They're assuming people playing this are all just complete pussies. At all times. Anyway, we've thoroughly searched this place, so let's get this fire going before she kills us. Anyway. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. By the way, y'all, um, you can actually opt for a motion complete, oops, a complete set of motion controls if you want to by tilting the camera and stuff. But I, I prefer physical controls. Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? I think, well, I, I wish we had some booze. God uh, damn it. There's a fridge. Well, uh, if I had known that ahead of time. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of just I'm not feeling it yet. No, don't be a dick. Let's reassure her. Let's talk to her. Am be a good I dude. Doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean... I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's it's not your fault. Sounds okay, like Jess, it is. I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Well, I am liking your confidence, Mike. The shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please. Oh my god, man. There's no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is. Oh god, I don't like this. You're gonna make me close the shit. Oh no. And I know he's right there. I know he's right there. Oh no. Oh no. Close it! Oh god. Oh my god. Close it. Okay, we're done here. Voila. Shutters are shut in. Now, where were There's also a bedroom as we found. That might I'm be. I'm sorry. A... I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out and it's hard for me to like keep this up and. What? Keep, keep what? Look. I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm... A virgin? Really kind of insecure. Oh. Same with every girl on the planet, brother. Oh, God. Um, reassure. Be reassuring. I don't know if that's the right thing to say. Jess. You've got to be kidding. You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you, too. I am definitely ready to be handled. 
I don't like this. I'm a little scared. Like... I, I, I'm worried these dudes are the first to go. Is this how they do the sex scene? Through the eyes of this dude? I don't like it. It's an evil spirit. The fuck? Fuck. Sounds like a radio turned on. I got Rose. I got Rose. Okay, guys, I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. What the fuck is this? Her phone! Oh my god! It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Does that not fucking bother you? Oh, fuck! Thank God, damn it! What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us, and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> careful, girl. Careful. She's mad as hell, and she's gonna storm out. Hey! Yeah, bricks! That means you! I know! What the fuck are you trying to do? You want to ruin our fun that bad? Well, guess what? You can't! You can't ruin our good time because Michael and I are gonna fuck! That's right, we are going to have sex and it's gonna be hot! So enjoy it because I know we're going to! Well, goddamn. Give me a break. <sighs> oh my god! What the fuck? Uh, uh, what? Uh, holy fuck, man! Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. I don't know if I wish they were or if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. That was a little spooky, man. I wonder if, if I had scared her. You know what, man? Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. If I didn't scare her, she may not have dropped her phone. It wouldn't have made her grab it and run to the door and taunt the beast. That's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like... Have a seance? Maybe we went too far. I'm a little scared, guys. And I really fucking hope that I I don't know if she's dead. I don't know if Jess is done. <sighs> Damn it. I want to keep as many people alive as physically possible. I really do, but at the same time, their death is kinda of half the fun. I know that sounds a little fucked up, but it's come on, it's a horror. Game. <laughs> Ow! Okay. I think so. Look, There's a goddamn what? button. There was something behind the books. What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? Push the damn. For four, I guess. It's gonna be a hidden area. Hidden area. Actually, hold on. Back off for a minute. Let me look around. Stay here, dude. That's what they want you to do. Okay, anyway. Alright, let's just push it. Just push it. Oh, panel opens. Head explodes. Are we like in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's around, Cap. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know this place is super old. So, should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Now we're swapping. Look at that. Hey, where the hell is it? Here we go. A picture. 
of the girls. Another clue. See, I did miss one. I missed clue number one. Damn it! Anyway. A portrait of the Washington twins. This must have been taken a few months before they disappeared. What? Whoa, is what this... did you find? I will take them and bleed them like pigs and rip their soft white skin off. Fucking 16 years. 16 years I waited for pretty little Hannah and Beth. That is fucked up, bro. Holy cow. No, be honest with her, man. Tell her what's up. No, Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I, I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. See, someone was watching us. Hold on a minute. Let me go back inside. There was something up in the box. Or is that just his reflection? Yeah, it's just his reflection. Alright, let's get out of here. God, this is scary, man. Oh, I knew it. Creepy mask. Do you think someone was actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. That is not at all scary. That, okay, that looks like a Native American guy. There's a letter here. What's it say? Saw that crazy guy again. Looks Hold like. On. Let's check it out. A letter from Josh's mother about the Native American tribes that used to live on the mountain. On the back, it's a scrawled note about a strange man that she saw near the lodge. November 8th, 2013. Dear Dr. Swafham, Thank you for your response. It's good to know that the tribe still feels an attachment to the land here, even if we have a few unfortunate problems. Graffiti, people sleeping in the outbuildings. This is their, an this is their ancestral home, after all. I have made contact with the descendants of the tribe and intend to make a donation to their elder council. Healing the wounds of the past won't be easy, but I feel it's a step that is necessary. Yours sincerely, Melinda Washington. Saw that crazy guy again. Hanging around the generator shed. I'm going to start keeping a record. That would scare me. That's all the way down here. That's clue 31. So yeah, it depends what character you are. By Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Look at all these dudes. Yes, the bad karma goes back a long way. Ancient, ancient tribal grounds that this place is built on. I would not be surprised. It's cliche as fuck, sure, but... That's how it goes, guys. It's a door. I don't know if I want to go to the door just yet. You know what? Hold on. I'm gonna. That looks like it's the right way. Maybe it's for the best. <sighs> so, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? Well, there was that guy I told you whoa, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. <gasps> you hear that? That was Josh. Coming from the kitchen. <gasps> Josh! Josh! Oh. Coming, hold on! Of course! Ashley, what's going on? Bring it in! Ashley! Are you come? Come on, man! Ash? Oh, God. Ash! Oh! Fuck me! Oh! Oh, my God, it's him!
Look at this crazy. He's got a clown mask for show. This is not good, guys. Shoot the fucker. Looks like he's taunting us, guys. God, that's scary, dude. That is really scary. I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. I prefer Sam over Josh. Um, I don't know, they're both pretty good folk. I like them both. I. I think I like Sam, though. She seems pretty level-headed. I'm gonna pick Sam. Oh, I definitely prefer Matt. That's an easy question. Oh, God. I like both of these people, but I really like Chris. I'm gonna go with Chris. Seems like a good dude. For Mike, prefer I prefer Mike. Jessica's kind of a dumb bitch. Definitely Josh. Definitely Ashley. So tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? I dislike Emily. She's a bitch, man. A bit too bitchy for your taste. A little. Often the lack of confidence manifests itself as overconfidence. Think about that. Is that not just a little bit like you? Oh, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Jesus, man.